Good morning, everybody. Hey, long time coming. A lot of work went into this thing. This happens to be our first 2,000 horsepower Godzilla engine. The Godzillas came out in 2021. We were one of the first companies and a few others that decided to take hands-on building these things. We build them with superchargers all the time. We build them uh, naturally aspirated. But this is our first race one. This is going to run alcohol, and it's going to run a pro charger, about 30 to 40 pounds of boost. Uh, again, just to give you some highlights, this is an aluminum rod engine. Uh, it's a dry deck motor. There's no water in this engine except for the cylinder heads. They're going to run a little pump and run some water through the cylinder heads. Nothing in the block whatsoever. Uh, so again, a lot of work on it. The cylinder heads themselves, we got these from uh, Willis Performance. We do a lot of work for Willis Performance, and we go hand in hand with them. These happen to be uh, stage three heads. They are ported, polished, uh, beryllium seats, bronze guides, titanium valves, and retainers and keepers, and you know who knows what kind of springs. But uh, I'll tell you, spring pressure on these are about 800 to 1,000 open. Uh, these are we are running the Jessel rocker system. We are also running uh, the Jessel uh, lifters, and this ones we had the lifter bores opened up about 60 thousandths or 905 lifters, solid lifters at that. The camshaft of this is around 290 duration, 800 lift, badass motor. Uh, we go into the timing cover. This is an Indy timing oil pump. This is oil pump is built in a timing cover right now and the oil pan. This is a wet sump uh, oil pan, but what a cool setup on this thing. Eh? These guys are, I'll tell you, some of these companies are starting to make some really cool stuff for the Godzillas, and uh, I'm glad we're building these because uh, we have a blast building. We've built probably 40 or 50 Godzillas, but this is our first 2,000 horsepower race engine. This should go down the track in about four seconds. Uh, <coughs> our, excuse me, our balancer is innovator. I had to drill and put pins in it to extend that job our crankshaft so we have so it had three keyways tied into it so this thing is going to hold some uh, massive horsepower and you got to tie that all together uh, it's been a lot of fun but came apart numerous times to get everything right if i was just to tell you on the rod clearance the rod clearance on this is three and a half to six thousandths put that in a stock car like that and forget about it you'll be rod knocking that thing in a second i had to drill the rod bearings to make them clip into the cap it was a lot of work a lot of fun I can't wait to build some more. So again, call us, 1-800-267-3940. We'll make your dream come true. Peace.